shout out to my friends overseas. This is my 1992 Geo Tracker in 2.7K, 30 frames per second, doing a camera test. But while I do a camera test, I will talk about these vehicles. In America, this was called the Geo Tracker, also the Suzuki Sidekick. This is the twin of the Suzuki Sidekick here in America. It was sold under Chevrolet. That's right, there's a Chevrolet logo and around it is a globe. Overseas, I think they were also called the Suzuki Sidekick at one point, correct me if I'm wrong. Also the Vitara and the Escudo and the Jimny. They're Jimnys now, but here's mine. Very proud of it. Here in America, we don't have the option of many small SUVs. Today I'm hanging out at the Mile of Cars. And this is it right here in America. This is probably the smallest capable SUV. This is our only option right here, Jeep Renegade. I was actually contemplating getting one of these. Almost convinced my mom to get one. That's a future video that I'll talk about. There it is. It's all we have in America for a small SUV option. So, are any Geo Tracker Suzuki Sidekick potential owners cross shopping one of these? A Renegade, since this is the only choice we have for a brand new small SUV. I don't know about overseas, but this is the most popular off road vehicle in America Jeep Wrangler. These go for up to $60,000, maybe even $75,000. They get V8s now. But these are really expensive. I think Rubicon start off at about 50. So there you go, guys. Shout out to my overseas friends. There are people in America like myself that appreciate small SUVs. That's why I got a Geo Tracker. Almost got a Jeep Renegade.